Hello, thank you for this opportunity to talk about some of the highlights from the work of the IEEE Computer Society Ad Hoc Committee on Open Science and Reproducibility. The committee was formed in early summer of 2020 and worked through the year on various aspects, primarily focusing on reproducibility. Uh, the goal of the committee was to analyze models, practices, and experiences in supporting open science and reproducibility within the IEEE Computer Society based on the recommendations that came out of the National Academy for Science, Engineering, and Medicine's report on reproducibility and replicability in science. There's a URL at the bottom of the slide pointing to that report. The key activities that we were engaged in were reviewing the report, the, the National Academy's report, to identify the most relevant recommendations, uh, to perform a survey of the activities that are ongoing activities and practices um, across the IEEE uh, by uh, a survey of uh, journal and magazine editors in chief, conference chairs and workshop chairs. We also did a deep dive on some of the key issues uh, related to ensuring reproducibility, such as the different roles and responsibilities across the stakeholders, infrastructure support, workflows and logistics, incentives and norms for the different stakeholders, for the publishers, authors, and for the readers. And of course, the economic issues as well as sustainability issues related to reproducibility. We looked at some case studies, for example, the transactions on parallel and distributed system has a pilot effort on using badging uh, to support reproducibility to the transparency uh, and, and, and the submission of code and data and we did a study of the effectiveness of those approaches. The red URL in red points you to the committee uh, page. Here are some of the recommendations. The report itself is online on the, on the webpage that I had shown you on the previous slide. Key recommendations were, first of all, recognize the urgency of this issue and the need to take action, uh, develop a cross-cutting strategic and implementation plan that has clear goals for the technical committees, for workshop and conference organizers for publications, and then establish some best practices. Deploy the necessary support infrastructure. This is to support artifacts submission, their evaluation and integrated workflow that allows these artifacts to be published along with the, with the, with the uh, publication itself. And of course, uh, create a mechanism for, uh, for example, for badging. Develop a coordinated reproducibility communication plan and then coordinate with other stakeholders, other societies and organizations. And finally, establish a task force whose role it is to implement these recommendations. Um, thank you for your attention. Here's a list of the committee members who contributed to this report. And once again, I've included the URL for the committee website. Thank you for the attention and uh, I'll be happy to take any questions.